Prince George is celebrating his 11th birthday with a new photo. Catherine Middleton and Prince William released a new portrait to commemorate their eldest son's milestone on July 22. Taken by Princess Catherine in Windsor earlier this month, the photo maintains a royal tradition. The Prince and Princess of Wales, both 42, have shared birthday portraits of George annually since he was a baby, a practice that also includes his younger siblings, Princess Charlotte, 9, and Prince Louis, 6. The new black and white portrait shows Prince George looking sharp in a dark blazer and white shirt. In the Instagram Stories version, he wears a friendship bracelet on his left wrist, possibly a keepsake from attending Taylor Swift's London concert in June. His parents posted the photo on social media with the message, wishing Prince George a very happy 11th birthday today. While this tradition continued for Charlotte and Louis this year, there was some doubt if new photos of their children's birthdays would be released. In March, Catherine issued a rare statement after news agencies removed a Mother's Day photo taken by William due to suspicions of editing. Like many amateur photographers, I do occasionally experiment with editing. I wanted to express my apologies for any confusion the family photograph we shared yesterday caused, she explained. Prince Louis and Princess Charlotte's latest birthday portraits were unedited and taken by their mother, who announced in late March that she was undergoing cancer treatment. Prince George is expected to celebrate his birthday privately with his family. However, he has made several public appearances recently. Alongside attending Trooping the Color on June 15, he also went to a Taylor Swift concert with his father and sister on June 21 and joined Prince William at the UEFA European Championship soccer game between England and Spain on July 14. Although George is destined to become monarch, his parents aim to ease him into royal duties. William is trying to normalize it. They're not in denial, and there's a lot of thought being given to it, which was not always the case, Robert Hardman, author of The Making of a King, King Charles III and the Modern Monarchy, told People. With George, the focus is to ensure that he and his siblings understand their future roles without fear, making the transition as seamless and pleasant as possible. Crucially, it's both of them, William and Catherine, Hardman added. While previous royal generations had predetermined futures, Prince William had more autonomy in his education, military service, and early royal duties, a freedom he wants for his son. There is no expectation that any royal duties are going to kick in until George is well into his twenties, a Kensington Palace source stated in the book. Before he was even made a page at the coronation, William and Catherine wanted to ask him if he felt comfortable about it because he was clearly the youngest. It turned out he was keen. Prince William prioritized his family when Princess Catherine underwent abdominal surgery in January and announced her cancer diagnosis in March, taking a break from public duties to support her and maintain a normal routine for Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. They are a very tight family unit, and he wants to be there for them, Hardman told People. So much of what they do with those kids is about normalizing life and not making them feel like they are in a special gilded cage. They are a modern royal couple, added Hardman. There would have been more delegation, in the past. He doesn't want to leave it all to the nanny.